Hey, guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are actually going to be talking about high size and low size. So, guys, before we get into the video, if you're new to the channel and you're interested in motorsport as well as motorcycle content, please consider subscribing to the channel because I do post content on a really regular basis. And one sub to the channel would be Bazinga. So, guys, without further delay, let's get right into the video. A high side is a motorcycle accident that can be characterized by sudden and violent rotation of the bike along its long axis. What, this, uh, what happens is actually the bike suddenly loses traction, it slips, then it regains traction. This actually produces a torque which flips the rider over the handlebars of the bike. Because the loss of traction and the regainment of the traction is so sudden and so violent, it catches the rider off guard. And once caught off guard, he does not get any time to actually react to the changes that, that are taking place, which results in an accident. High side, is an, high side is an accident that can cause severe injuries to the rider as well because the rider is actually flipped over the handlebars of the bike and he is tossed up into the air and when he lands he can also be subjected to some broken bones or some broken joints and basically if you are involved in the high side your chances of injuries and severe injuries is really very high. The main causes for the bike to high side are the rear wheels that are locked during braking incorrect downshift technique or uh, under excessive engine braking, excessive throttle in cornering or coming out of the corner, change in the track conditions such as uh, the presence of wa wa water, oil etc. on the track, new tires that are not fully adjusted to the track or the road, as well as reduced tire friction. These are the reasons and the major reasons why the bike high sides. So guys from high side, let's move on to low side. Low side is a phenomenon in which the rider actually crashes in the direction that he is cornering. The rear wheel and the front wheel in this accident slide out because of which the rider crashes. It is caused by excessive braking or excessive acceleration into the corner. It can be easily avoided by actually downshifting before entering the corner or braking before entering the corner. A low side crash is not as impactful or as brutal as a high side crash because the rider is not actually flipped over the handlebar or it does not land in a very awkward position or very hard in a very hard position which actually causes less severe injuries and uh, he can actually get away with it in a very minimal uh, manner. So this is why the low side is actually much much less brutal than the high side. So guys that was all for this video. I hope you got an in-depth look uh, and uh, understood what actually high side and low side is and what these crashes are. Also guys if you are new to the channel make sure that you hit the subscribe button and you ding the bell icon and if you like the video make sure to hit the like button if you dislike the video hit the dislike button twice. Also guys I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.